All right, Blade Smiths, the kill test. Doug? The small sword. To see what kind of lethal damage your weapons will do, I will take your sword and deliver lethal cuts and stabs on this ballistic dummy. All right, Derek, you ready for this? I think so. I'm really looking forward to see how the blade performs, but at the same time, I'm nervous about the blade catching in a rib and snapping. Come on, baby. My heart is in my throat right now. All right, Derek, let's talk about your blade right here. It is light, it is pointy, it is sharp. Your weapon will kill. Thank you. Good job. Bob, it's quite something to follow up with. You ready? That's what I came for. My heart is just pounding. I mean, I have confidence, but you don't really know because I haven't done any tests. I didn't even stab a watermelon. All right, Bob, the point is sharp enough to deliver a straight thrust all the way through this ballistic dummy. Your weapon, sir, will kill. Thank you. Bladesmiths, welcome to our strength test, the flex test. Now, what I'm gonna do is take each of your small swords and bend them 45 degrees in both directions. Now, if you nailed your heat treat and construction, everything should stay true. Hey, Phil and Dirk, go ahead. All right. I'm very impressed. His sucker went 45 degrees both ways. <laughs> Great job. Thank you. Bob, you ready? Yep, I think so. Now I'm really worried. I had to forge it out in one day. I had to assemble it all in the same day to get everything put together just so I could turn in a sword. I mean, I'd already broken one, so I knew it could be brittle. Each degree that it's going, I'm going, is it going to break here? Is it going to break here? Agonizing. OK, come back now. Then you go to the other side. Well, Bob, good news is your blade didn't break. What a relief. Didn't spring back to true, but it did come most of the way back. Overall, nicely done. Thank you. Bob, Derek, both of your finale weapons were strong, deadly, and sharp. However, there can only be one Forged and Fire champion, and that champion is. Derek, congratulations. You are the Forged and Fire champion. Bob, unfortunately, your small sword did not make the cut. Bob, you made a beautiful sword, but during that strength test, your blade took a bend that set and didn't straighten out. And that's why we're letting you go. I understand. Please surrender your blade. Oh, I absolutely agree with the judge's decision that Derek did have the better blade. I may not be called Forge and Fire Champion, but I gained so much more valuable experience that it's immeasurable.